evaluate one-half plus three-fifths times five-sevenths. We will remember our order of operation. Remember parentheses comes first, then exponents and roots, then multiplication and division from left to right, and addition and subtraction working from left to right. In this problem, we do not have any parentheses or exponents. So we will check those off, and we will start with our multiplication and division. Here we have multiplication that we need to do first. We see that we have 3 fifths times 5 sevenths. We have a common factor in the numerator and denominator of 5 that we can divide out. 5 divided by 5 is equal to 1, and 5 divided by 5 is equal to 1. So then we multiply our numerators together. 3 times 1 is equal to 3, and 1 times 7 is equal to 7. Now we need to add. We are going to add 1 half plus 3 sevenths. When you add, you need a common denominator. The least common multiple of 2 and 7 is 14. So we need to write these fractions with 14 as the denominator. I multiplied this denominator by 7 to get 14, so I need to multiply the numerator by 7 as well. I multiplied 7 times 2 to get 14, so I need to multiply the numerator by 2, and I get 6. We have the same denominator, so we will add our numerators. 7 plus 6 is equal to 13, and we keep the denominator. So 13 fourteenths is the answer to this problem.